Hey sis, welcome to another vlog. I am in Norfolk, Virginia. Obviously the background looks different. I am not at home. I am technically not on vacation, but we're making a trip out of it, right? So I'm speaking at a brunch on Saturday. Today is Thursday night. And so I just got here. I met up with Crystal. She's putting on she's the hostess of the brunch so I met up with Crystal she picked me up from the airport and we went sat down and had dinner and so just checked into my room I am happy <laughs> I'm happy I'm slightly overwhelmed but like in a good way right because I've only known Crystal from Instagram we connected on Instagram we've only had conversations like on the phone and through DMs whatever and it's just like nice to know that the vibes are the same in real life as they are on social media I think that's one of the like beneficial things about social media is that it does connect you with so many people you know a lot of the times we focus on the negative or you hear mostly about the negative of social media and the vanity of social media but there's no way that I would get to meet and connect with people with y'all with people like Crystal and really foster these types of sisterhoods <laughs> without social media without the internet and so for that I'm so grateful and so appreciative of you all I'm gonna do better with vlogs y'all you know I'm a I am a private person and but I do want to um be more transparent with you all and let you get to really know me on a more personal level so I'm gonna do better I'm gonna do better sis but you know show me grace <laughs> okay <laughs> this went all out and I can tell like she actually watches my content because y'all know I go in on Prosecco and she doesn't have just one she got two bottles she has a charcuterie board which was put together by Gray Charcuterie in Virginia if you're in the Virginia area I am in that Norfolk Virginia Beach area this is her information here I'll leave it here, but she put together such a beautiful charcuterie board and left it. Y'all know charcuterie and Prosecco? Baby, that has unique written all over it. And then not only that, but my girl made sure that I was safe because I told her my husband don't play with me. <laughs> he don't play about me, okay? And so she got me like the little door lock that I've always seen on TikTok for my hotel room and then the little door stopper that buzzes we put it underneath the door so i'm gonna go do that now um so much merch sweatshirts t-shirts i mean the room is stocked and she just fed me dinner like we just went to a restaurant and she my girl she took me on a date <laughs> The room is really nice. The bathroom is really nice. Um, it does have the little closet area inside of the bathroom. Full length mirror because, you know, we got to make sure the outfits are on point. <laughs> I'll make sure to share the outfits that I'm wearing on the trip with you all. And then the view. This area is the water side. This is my first time here, so... I don't know nothing, okay? But this area is called the Waterside, from what I gather. And I can see like all ships from the room, which is so nice. I'm like looking over the water, which you'll see as well. So, you know, it's just, she was just so thoughtful about how she put this together. She told me about a place close by that we're going to go for breakfast. So I'm going to pop my Prosecco, unwind, and I will catch you in the morning. <laughs> Now, Friday morning, I'm about to go across the street to get some breakfast, but I wanted to like sit down and have breakfast by myself. Like, you know, the best part about being on vacation 
This is not vacation. The best part about being on a trip by yourself is being able to eat in peace. Eat where I want, you know. Y'all don't know, but if you follow me on Instagram, then you know that I just came from Universal, where I spent the week with my family. Um, and so I'm literally just coming off of that trip where I had to bend to my son and my husband's wishes since it was my son's birthday. So we were doing breakfast in all the eating places he wanted to go to. Girl, I am pizza out. Do you hear me? Pizza out. So I'm excited. I'm going to go across the street. I'm going to bring you with me. We're going to go see what the water side has to offer. She did tell me about this really, she said it's really good. The biscuits were really good. Called the egg. So we're going to go there. I am just attempting to iron out the wrinkles in these pants. These are the trousers that I got from H&M a couple hauls ago. Um, and they're like super easy to pack. So I really wanted to bring them. But they wrinkle and crush so easy. And this iron, it's not doing what I need it to do <laughs> at all. I'm trying to hurry up because we are doing a boat ride today. Um, so I already told them. I'm going to be on the boat, not in the water. Okay, I watch way too many shark documentaries to get into this water. These bull sharks and stuff ain't going to get me. <laughs> so. I'm staying on the boat. However, we got to be there at 11.45. It is now 9.30, and I still haven't left yet to go get breakfast. Show. Sure. I'm trying to take advantage of this little solo trip while I got it, you know? This iron ain't doing it, girl. It's fine. Who cares about the wrinkles? Just me. It's fine. I mean, let's be real. As soon as I walk and sit down, oops, shouldn't have done it that way. As soon as I walk and sit down, these pants will be hella wrinkled. So it don't even matter. It don't even matter. All right, let's go get dressed. about with my camera <laughs> um, she had told me that it was a big baby town I still I'm still so shocked to see all of these like, you know we barely see that in Atlanta <laughs>
brunch event, the rooftop brunch experience with Crystal Elegance events here in the DMV. So it is time for me to get ready. I, those clips that y'all saw of me getting my coffee and stuff was two hours ago, but I've been on the phone with my mom, just yapping it up. And now I only have an hour to get ready. So I was thinking about wand curling my hair. That was my initial thought. But now that I only have an hour, I think, I don't think that's an option. So <laughs> I think I'm just going to like pull this part back so that my natural hair will blend with the curl pattern and I'm just gonna put conditioner in it. That's what I'm gonna do. But I did wanna tell you about my boat experience and stuff yesterday while we get ready. And oh my gosh, it was so good, so good. So I've done like, you know, boat days or whatever in um, Florida, but this is my first time doing it. We were in Virginia Beach. So good. I will leave the contact information for, it was a pontoon boat, but I'll leave the contact information for the company that we use because they was lit. <laughs> it was lit. It's black owned and they gave everything that needed to give. Okay. And then we were able to um, stop by one of the restaurants on the shore, on the docks whatever, and have lunch. And that was really good too. I had a really bomb crab cake. I was very, very much pleased. I was also very hungry, <laughs> but it was really good. We had a good time. I went down to the hotel lobby because they have a Starbucks there. But why they didn't have no chai at eight o'clock in the morning? She's like, oh, I'm sorry, we're out of chai. How? It's eight o'clock in the morning. So I tried the apple... Oat, apple crisp oatmeal nope so I tried the apple crisp oat milk macchiato it's actually pretty good not too sweet but sweet enough to enjoy you know I like like medium sweetness so that's really I'm impressed I'm impressed like I would order this again y'all know that I wore a scarf yesterday on the boat so there's that tan line and yes I'm missing two nails. I bought glue last night so that I can put them back on, but I don't have scissors, so I <laughs> wanna get scissors from the lobby. Let me show you what I'm wearing. Ugh. Don't look behind me. I know there's a lot happening behind me. Don't, don't look. Okay. So I'm gonna wear that pink set that I picked up from Zara that y'all saw in my Zara haul. I'm gonna wear that set and then I picked up these shoes from Macy's. <laughs> Are you dying? They're so cute. Sorry, that was loud. They're so cute. I had posted those in my Instagram stories while I was in Macy's and y'all ate me up. They're like, girl, how you posting the shoes and no link? So I did link those <laughs> over on Instagram. I'll make sure to link them down below. They're by DKNY. Um, and they're actually pretty comfortable. I obviously have not worn them out yet, but from just walking around in the store, they're pretty comfortable. Um, they didn't squeeze my toes. What size did I end up getting? I think I ended up getting a nine in them. Or did I end up getting a nine and a half? I can't remember. And I don't have the box on me. I don't see the I'll leave it in the description what size I ended up getting. I also got these shoes. Are you, are you serious? Like, come on, focus. It's so beautiful and the camera is not picking up the shine and look at that heel. Oh, oh, gorgeous. I'm in love. I actually, I think I picked these up. Yeah, so these are size nine as well. So those chrome shoes might be an eight and a half. Can't remember, but I'll update y'all in the description box. And then I also got these. Oh, look at the heel. Y'all know I love a pearl. Ooh, those nails. Ooh, those nails. Oh, but it's like a really light kind of bone color. I also picked these up. Oh no, I actually got these in a 10. Um, so these run a whole size 
small okay so size up a whole size for these and then look at the heel it has like the little chrome situation there and then the pearl mm, so cute it also has a little bit of like vinyl on this side so we'll see how foggy those get because you know when it comes to the vinyl shoe they get foggy and then of course y'all see the <laughs> i love this i picked this up at zara <laughs> Of course here's the zara tag it's 50 dollars. honestly i don't think it's worth 50 dollars. i don't think i can see that this is one of those things where the threads are going to start pulling on you my forehead looks ridiculous uh thank god for makeup but it's so cute let me show it to you actually i'm gonna wear it for dinner tonight so i'll show it to you then but yeah then I went and I hop, skipped, and jumped over to Aldo. And I got this beauty. Oh my God. She's so stunning. I had to get something silver to match my chrome shoe. So I picked that up. And I also got um, this little uh, black bag that I've been carrying around since I've been here. Ooh, now it's blue. Come on, don't be blue. It's a Jacquemus dupe pretty much with the one handle situation. So cute. And Aldo was actually having like a 50% off sale. So I think that bag was less than $40. And I got like jewelry and some other stuff as well. Cause you know, I can't just like <laughs> shop and buy one thing, but we need to get this show on the road. So I'm gonna go in the shower and wet and condition this hair to get the curls popping so they can dry while I put on my makeup and everything else and then we can blend my natural leave out with the rest of it so let's get this show on the road because I can't be late and I got an hour Ooh, these nails ah. Okay, what time is it? It is now, it is now 10.53. Uh, my sister is now on the way and I don't have no makeup on. <laughs> Lord said help. <laughs> okay first of all i'm not this bright in real life okay so <laughs> i don't know why this camera is trying me because i'm not this bright in real life i think it's all that i think i know it's the lighting okay so just trust the process trust the process i'll show you natural like it when i'm done <laughs> I know I still look crazy, but I promise you I don't. It's the lighting. I mean, I had to pull out my little fancy mirror just to make sure I don't look crazy. Girl, let me look. And I only got one lash on, so I look crazy. But come out here in natural light so I can show you that I'm not, I don't look as, oh, Jesus. Come on, camera, you can do it. Come on, camera. Don't, don't embarrass me like this now, y'all. <laughs> I'm not this bright. Maybe I need to come out here. Is that any? <laughs> I still look bright, Jesus. Maybe if I come over here. Okay, now I'm just real yellow. Y'all, I promise you it looks like skin. I promise you it look like skin. I prom <laughs>
like two weeks <laughs> since that last clip but we'll get into why it's been so long i left va um the monday the following monday but sunday i spent with my family like my sister my nieces and my nephew i spent all of sunday with them um but for the brunch oh my god y'all i was so nervous <laughs> I was so nervous leading up to the brunch because it's like, okay, it's one thing to be like, you know, me and the camera, me and the camera. And if you know me in person, then you know that I'm actually a pretty introverted person. So the idea of having like all these eyes on, on me, I was so nervous, but it turned out to be such a great time. Like all of my girls that I met were amazing and just full of energy and personality. Like, and look, they was getting to it. You hear me? My girls was getting to it, okay? But I met so many of you all who live like in that area who drove to be close to us. Um, so thank you to everyone who came out. We had a blast and now I have to go back. This time I'm going to go back and go to the DC area and we'll do it all again um, so I can meet more of my DC babes who was like, girl, sis, that was far. Okay, it was, it was a drive, but I'm happy. I, I'm really happy at how it all turned out. We had such a good time. And then, like I said, Sunday I went yes. out with my sister and her family. Um, so and we... <laughs> My sister's kids are so different from my kids where they're like, they want to be outside. They She lives like, is it a canal? Is it a pond? A lake? I don't know. She has water behind her house. <laughs> and they have these turtles that come up and greet them and they feed the turtles and she has a garden. Like, they are the nature family, right? She's, she's like my dad. They outside. Me and my kids. He's coming. That's, I guess, the city life versus being out there in nature. Like, she's in nature. I can't say it's, it's the suburbs. It's the suburbs. But I love, I mean, I love her house and how it's just set up right behind the water or 
in front of how the water is right behind her i love it and the kids i mean the kids just enjoy being outside they don't want to be in the house I love it. I love it so much. Um, and then we also went and checked out the Kalana Times Target collection where I met some more of you all at Target. So hey sis, if you're watching, thanks for shopping with me, girl. Um, so I'll try on and show you the pieces that I picked up from the first drop. I know she had a second drop more recently, but girl, I was still sick and shut in, which leads me to why y'all are just getting this vlog two weeks later sis i think i picked it up from the plane i didn't have corona but i did get an upper respiratory infection and i swear it was worse than when i did have corona i have been in the bed no energy whatsoever i missed my birthday <laughs> because I was so sick and now it looks like my son has picked it up so we're playing nurse to him today but we have a lot of fun and exciting things and very new things for me that's happening this week so I am going to be vlogging again so I'm going to just jump and start into that next vlog so I will see you next week definitely like this video if you like hanging out with me leave me a comment down below let me know what other like behind the scenes things that I should include in the vlogs help me help you okay we already started the video saying give me grace now I need your help with what you want to see okay <laughs> but thanks for watching sis and I will catch you next week's video.